Hi there, so I'm just making a short video on um, how to get to animated uh, wallpaper for your Stream Deck. Now, I've watched a few videos on YouTube and uh, most of them suggest that you use uh, Photoshop or the Apple equivalent software, which means a lot of downloading, um, a lot of paying for different things, etc. Uh, I've found an alternate method of doing this a lot, a lot faster, and actually it's all web, web browser based, so it's actually it's all free. And um, until Stream Deck's actual software allows you to actually do this with, you know, convenience instead of doing it the way I'm showing you, um, this is probably the fastest and easiest way of doing this. Um, so first things first, um, you have to understand a little bit with Stream Deck. So what I've actually done is each tile is a different picture or a different GIF. So it's obviously one big GIF, and I've divided it down into smaller little GIFs, and then got them to work all together simultaneously. Hence why you get the little. Sonic running around in circles. So to get this to um, to work, um, first of all, we have to start from the beginning and, and find ourselves a, a GIF to work with. So first things first, I want to find a image I want to put on the background as an animated background on my stream deck. So I'm going to look for a um, for an animated GIF which I like. Um, I want to go for something a bit subtle. That's a bit um, a bit bright that one. So maybe some bit more subtle, maybe something more dark. Now, we have to ensure we get a image which is suitable for this. Um, I mean, you can upscale images obviously, but the higher, higher the uh, resolution, the better. Now, I also believe each of these tiles um, is currently 72 by 72 pixels. So it's roughly the resolution works that'd be 360 by 216. I believe you can go as high as 144 by 144, which obviously dramatically increases the resolution. Um, but I'm happy just sticking with the 72 by 72. I, I haven't seen really much clarity in, in, in the increase. I'm not, I haven't even tried to be honest here, so I, I don't even know if it works. But um, I'll just stick to what, what, what I know works, so we'll just go along with that. So I just googled uh, cool GIF, so we'll see what's sort of around. It's a nice little dark purple one there. And obviously every image will tell you the resolution in Google as well, which is good, it's nice and handy. Uh, that looks pretty cool. It's like some purple rain or something like that. That's um, that's, that looks like a winner. So I might um get that one. I'll just uh, save the image. Just pop it on the desktop. Now I'm actually gonna just so I don't um get get it lost or anything like that. I'm actually gonna save it to the folder that Stream Deck is installed to. So I'm gonna it's on my C drive. It's under uh, Program Files, Elgato, and that's my Son Sonic animated one. I'm just going to create a new folder. I'm just going to call it uh, Purple Rain. Go in there. I'm just going to copy and drag the image in there. Done and done. All right. So next part is to is to um, uh, crop it into that 300 by 216 format, and then to break it down into 15 smaller images. So I came across this site called. Uh, easygift.com and I mean this is uh, 2020 mid 2020 so it, it looks quite nice easy to use and and um, I'm hoping they by the time you uh, use it I'm hoping it's the same easy to use format um, so first things first on this site we're gonna crop the image so literally there's little little tabs up here went to crop uh, choose file and I'm going to the Folder, in which I just put it the GIF on. There we are. So I'm uploading it. It's having a bit of a think, just uh, uploading the image. All right. So the picture is uploaded, and what I've done, I'll just um, go on down here and. Like I said, this is very easy to use website. I've just um, told it I want a width of 360 and a height of 216. And uh, this actually cropped box, you can move around to your to whatever you like. So I'd like, it, like to maybe get that particular cut there. So you just set it. And then finally you crop the image. And that is the cropped and saved image. So I'm just gonna save that to the desktop again. Okay. Drag and drop back into that folder I had. Um, the only reason why I am putting it all into the folder straight away, I've just, I've had other, I'm not sure with Stream Deck, but I've had other, other applications where I've moved folders and stuff and it just came up a whole lot of errors. So I just want to keep it all, all together. So that's the original uh, uncropped 
um, GIF, don't need that anymore, I'll get rid of that one, and I'll bring the new one in. Okay, that's all done. Now is to uh, cut them all down to size, okay? So because this is the old image, I need to upload the new image. I'm just gonna get back to crop again, find the new one, and upload. Okay, so the new updated image is has been uploaded. Um, so like I said, I need to uh, tell this to cut it into 15 different pieces. And this, like I said, this little um, little website is great for this stuff. It's just, I found the other ones you're really sort of mucking around. This one here, you can literally just type it on in all the numbers here. So from the top, I'm gonna go 70, sorry, this, so this measured measures from how much pixels you want from the top and, and from the left-hand side. So we go zero, zero, 72, and 72. So that should go to the very top left corner. Yep, that's the one. And I'm also gonna just click the square ratio, not that you'd have to, but. So once that's done, I'm gonna crop the crop the image. And see there, it's come up as that little one in the corner there. So I'm gonna save that image. And just so I keep it sort of universal, go one. I'm just currently just saving this to the desktop and I'll, I'll drop them over. So then we're gonna to go to the next box over, so it'd be 72, um, 72 uh, left of the corner. So I'll set that, so it's just popped over a little bit. And save that one. And obviously next one over, so 72 plus 72 is 144. Crop image, save, no, save as, and I'm just num numbering them uh, uh, one, one to fifteen. I didn't know the last one. I'll just, just, just fix that up right now. So I just did. Uh, one forty-four plus seventy-two is two sixteen. Crop image. You know, so it, it, it is a little bit tedious. Um, you know, it's uh, it's not the the fastest way I think of doing it. But like I said, after after. Watching a few videos, it just it, it, it honestly seemed like the most efficient way of doing it because um, everyone else um, basically had programs and they were mucking around and doing different features and this kind of stuff. Well, this is just sort of basic stuff. You don't really need to, you know, n know how to use Photoshop and all those kind of things. You can literally just just one at a time crop it. You know, it's just it seems the most fastest, easiest, and convenient way. Um, and as you see, I'm already, you know, as we, as I'm talking, I'm already up to the, uh, already half, pretty much halfway done on this. So I'll just, um, I'll just skip ahead now. All right, so I'm all done. Um, just made the 15 uh, little gifs. So as you can see, little gif and a little bit of an effect in there. Not be too good on this um, particular camera. And so what I'm going to do now is get it on the stream deck. Okay, so we can close all this stuff off. Get rid of that. Open up the Stream Deck program. Okay, so I'm just gonna create a new profile, and make it make it easy. So I'll just go up here and say new profile. Okay, and each one of these things, I mean, each tile is obviously programmable to what you want to do. But um, I'm just gonna just create some multi actions with no nothing actually working at the moment, just so I can show you and demonstrate it. Get rid of all those things. Obviously, you can go back in and fix it up for your own convenience. So, down up once we're on the tile, click on the little bottom here, say step from file, and I'm going to go to the purple rain and one, and obviously just work your way along. So, next one will be two, and so on, and so forth. Now, as you're doing this, you might realize down the bottom it will start to come up as GIFs. But you also find they may not be synced. That's because we need to resync it at the end. I'll show you that in a second. So I've just changed over the uh, last little tile here, with the uh, last bit of GIF wallpaper. Um, it's all um, it's all on there now, so it's looking looking good. Uh, if it does look a bit out of sync, very simple. If there is just um, just change your profile, change it to uh, to another one, and then bring it back again. Just allows it to um, to resync up. From the um, from the first little frame of the GIF and and make it look all good. Uh, 
so it doesn't actually give much justification on this um, on this particular camera, but um, it does look quite nice. So um, yeah, if you um, if you like the vid, just obviously give us a bit of a like and uh, subscribe if you like. I'm always posting up random videos, etc. Um, if you're if you found a better method or a better way of doing things, by all means, just uh, leave in the comments. Um, if you're you know, hopefully we can only hope that Stream Deck might even somehow just make a way for us not to do this all this little mucking around that can actually integrate with the software but uh, one can only hope um, but yeah hope you enjoyed the video and uh, good luck cheers